I can't remember the last time I did this. Um, please don't let me regret it. I vow to you on my own. You're never going to regret this. You are one in a million. And I promise you today that I'll always, always love you. Your Majesty, I am not happy. There's a big problem in the land. And you're not showing concern as the king. I'm not sure this is the way your father would have handled this situation. Ichi Ejendo. The problem is not as big as you feel. For your information, I have set detailed missionaries on motion. Before this time tomorrow, there will be results. Your Majesty, why not we start something this night? Why not we do something? You are the king. If you make a move, they will listen to you. Do something. Something else is bothering me. Listen, King Vincent. I guided your father while he sat on this throne. And you know I can guide you. Tell me what troubles you. The conspiracy against Kate was on the high side. She's the one I found for myself and love without limitation. I am not happy the way we frustrated her out of the palace. Um, I need to understand when you say we. I need to understand the people that construe this we because uh, I'm sure I'm not part of it. How could you? How could you exclude yourself, Jay Jindu? Were you not the one that told me that she cannot be the queen in this land? Your Majesty. From my interaction with her, she was not interested in being the queen mother of this land. All she wanted was to be a wife, and you denied her that. She complained bitterly that you don't even ejaculate inside her. And that is because of what I was told, that her son cannot be the next king in this land. Oyeze, I see that your conscience is beginning to prick you because of what you did to that beautiful woman. You alone made the decision that frustrated her out of this palace. Do not involve so many people. You are the king. You also have the power to change what you did because you took that decision alone. I'm calling your phone is switched off. Okay, I'm vexed. You get one people to just don't worry me since so I had to switch off my phone. No, well, I'm very late. It's fine. I have somebody in my room, and I'm suspecting that this particular package is going to be a problem. Yeah. So we're going to run in the room all way. You understand? Mm -hmm. 7 a.m. tomorrow, before your shift is over. You know, just no, no go to use your stunts. I can just consider your stunts. I trust you. Yeah. Okay. No fear. No problem. Uh, no problem. The drama go. I go search you. No, no, no. It's on this. Excuse me, sir. Sorry to disturb, but your car is blocking somewhere. Okay, I'll be down soon. <clears throat> What's that? Call from receptionist. Okay. My car is blocking a car that is about to drive out. Should please come and repack. Hurry up then. Oh, yes, yes, yes. 
I see that your conscience is beginning to prick you because of what you did to that beautiful woman. You alone made the decision that frustrated her out of this palace. Do not involve so many people. You are the king. You also have the power to change what you did because you took that decision alone. Even if I decide to handle it, how will I begin? Okay. Are we still on this? Are we still on what? Something is eating you up, Vincent. Something presumably so big that it has continued to give you sleepless nights. Vincent, you know I am your wife for crying out loud. And you also know I can go all out for you. Come on, tell me what the problem is. You know I can get the solution to it, right? Let me state it mildly and clearly to you. So that you will not have any reason to bring back this topic again. Listen and listen clearly. There is nothing that is wrong with me. And there is nothing wrong anywhere. And what if I don't believe that, my king? You can go ahead and believe whatever you want to believe. But remember, I'm the king. And kings always have issues bothering them. Come on, my king. Has this got to do with me not giving you a son yet? How can you say something like that? Eh? I am a consigned wife. If you must know, I discussed extensively with Ichie Ejindu, and he told me our problem has to do with something you did that has angered your late father. But my problem is, why have you refused to do the needful, my king? Oh. I can state it that you're part of my problems. How can you parade yourself as my wife and you went to hold a secret meeting with my enemy? If in all honesty, you are seeing Ichie Ejendo as your enemy, then the problem is deeper than I expected. The more I try to convince myself that he will change, the more he makes me realize I married the wrong man. The 
MTN number you have dialed is currently switched off. Please switched try off. again later. Thank you. Dear customer, the MTN number you have dialed is currently switched off. Please try again later. Thank you. Hello, hi, good morning. Yes, this is room 301. Yes, my partner just left the room to go repack his car, the car park, and he's not up yet. Yes, he just went up with his towel and his singlet. No, he hasn't returned. Oh, is, he, is everything okay? Okay, please do, thank you, thanks. Please know what I'm thinking. <laughs> there is nothing as good as having won on this women without spending a dime. <laughs> Uh, she's gonna wake up and she's gonna realize that I'm gone. Who, who, who is banging at that gate? Eh? Who are you? Who are you? Uh, no, it's me, Anita. Who are you, Anita? Man, are you asking me that question? You don't know me again. I know you, but I will not let you into this compound. No. Why? Oga specifically told me not to let you into this premises again. That is all. So, bye-bye. It's like... Uh... He's taking that shepherd that he normally takes. Uh, Please okay. allow me to go. Go, 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 and so you allowed her to stop the peace of the neighborhood, eh? I don't, I don't know. Maybe I should tie her up and keep her there. Eh? You don't know what to do with her. I see. Let her in. Okay, sir. Don't worry. My man is going to sack you. No, your, your man. Let me go. 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 I don't blame you. Ah, this girl won't let me rest. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. In the, in the, in the, in the value. Baby, you have to suck that bitch. Uh, 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 stop there. Stop, stop here. Stop here. Why are you here? What's your problem with him? Do you know what he did to me? What did he do to you? He insulted me. He humiliated me. What exactly did he say to you? He refused to open the gate for me. What's audacity? I give that instruction and I am clear on the instruction that I gave to him. What is your problem? Is it that you have a problem with listening to old men and following instructions? My love, why would you do that? It's clear. The reason is very simple. You're an expired project. I am done with you. I told him never to allow you in here again. Anita, please. Stop coming here. Okay, we're done. Namde. Baby, please. Namde. Come here. Namde, I got this lady out of this place. Yes, sir. 
She tries to be difficult. Carry her. My love, please, I beg you, please. Guys, say Love, okay? Hey, bring her, It's me, I need to pay. Yeah, we know it's you, oh yeah? And Lily. Yes, sir. If you get close to me, I'm going to descend on you. Just try and descend. Oh, it's not the case. I'm going to go. 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 I'm going to flex my life the way I feel it. Oh, oh, oh. Take it easy, cause you done not tomorrow. Cause you done not tomorrow. I beg, I beg, free my style. I beg, I beg, allow me to flex. I'd be you if my life. Oh. I'm not in for anything, darling. But don't forget to. Talk to you freely, sir. Of course you can. Why are you standing there like a ghost? I just want to uh, tell you one or two things, sir. Get to your point. Yeah, sir, you see, yes, I know you're my employer, uh, but age-wise, I'm old enough to be your father. I don't know if you realize this, sir. Get to your point. Sir, it's about the way you treat these ladies. How do I treat these ladies? Yes, sir, I have seen things. And when I say that this is hardly the way to treat women, I know exactly what I'm saying. You see, a woman is like fire. It can be both destructive and useful. Depends on how you handle it. Yes, sir. I'm trying very hard to understand where you're going with this. Sir, you see, when a woman is angry with you, it can cause you a whole lot of setbacks in life. Even the tears, the drop of tear from their eyes, it can, it can make God so angry. God is deeply moved by such things. That is why I say you have to soft pedal, sir. Are you done? Yes, sir. Go back to your duty post. Sir, is that... Sir? Do you want me to repeat myself? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. And then I have a Nandi. My old man, Gitman, who would never mind his business. I'm still keeping him at that job because of his sincerity and dedication to his job. He does not even know it. But then he shouldn't push me. Ijama. Yes, love. You've been married to my son, Vincent, for over two years now. You know him better. Knowing or not knowing him is not the problem here, ma'am. And what is the problem? The problem here is that your son, recent, has a problem. And that problem is affecting me. A problem he actually created and is not ready to solve it. What? Is there anything you know that I don't know? I spoke to Uche Ejendo, whom I know is the only one who can speak to King Vincent, your son. But guess what, man? He categorically told me that he has no time to waste on Vincent's case. That Vincent knows his problem already. Uh, 
This is the same thing he has been saying. But Vincent said he did not do anything. He even said that if Vincent fails to confess, that he will not produce an heir. Or may even die on the truth. Mom! Yes! You mean someone as elevated as Ichi Ejindo says something like that about your son and you are not bothered? You kept quiet. Ijama, oh, what do you want me to do? A lot, Mom. I have asked Vincent several times. He said he did not do anything. So do you want me to kill myself? Huh? Mom, we can do something. How? You are his mother. Use that to your power. Use the position as his mother to make him speak. You know he does not respect me, so he wouldn't say a word to me. But not to you, his mother. He respects you a lot. Please, mom. And you think I have not done that? You haven't. See, let me tell you something. Vincent is not only an adult, but he is also a king. I think he should be able to solve his problems. And what if he can't? Can't you see? We can actually help him, you know? See, Namre, if you allow me to address this case, honestly, I think your friend is in a danger of what happened to her. I'm just telling you the truth. See, Martins, you're already defending the he goats, and that is pissing me off. What do you mean I'm defending him? I'm telling you the truth. See, the fact that you said I'm defending him, that argument has been flawed. I'm just saying the truth. You want me to lie to you? No, I'm telling you the pure truth. Okay, you're not defending him. Then why are you saying that my friend cost everything? She was on her own when Ken came looking for her. Uh-uh, uh-uh. She vehemently declined when he asked her help. She said no. So what changed? Tell me what changed. You saw a man with a bright future, an handsome, tall-looking man, and boom, she went. Can you tell me at what point did she agree to say yes? Why? Well, she did because your friend kept pushing. He kept making promises. He kept appearing as a man who is so serious. Then she decided to give him a chance. See, yeah. if you want to listen to me very well, I will tell you the truth. We all know who Ken is. If he checks a lady, she has been asking a lady out for quite a while, and the lady gives him a hard time, he keeps going. As soon as he gets the lady, bam! As soon as that lady is trash, he leaves the lady and goes for another one. He has done that a million times! And your friend happens to be one million and maybe one, and he's still counting. We've lost count already. So, the fact that I said your friend bought this to herself is the binger of everything that happened to her. Am I wrong? No, I'm not wrong. So, can we conclude this as adults and just realize that your friend has made a mistake? So, we'll move on. The earlier would know where the mistake comes from, Kayla will begin to move on as adults. Okay? You are a you grown up lady and you, 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 you reason well. So let's just leave this in and just move on. If you and want me to offer you, you something, guys are I proud do. about it. One million, ten million, you are proud. Best of same feather. I'm not. Let me tell you something, Martins. Your friend is going to regret this. Okay, yes. till then. But your friend won't regret it when she knew what she was getting herself into and she stuck herself into a trap. You look at it, man. I know I, I, you are a, a lady that you reason. Just reason about it and tell me. Anyway, what do you, what can I offer you? I don't want anything. Hmm. Hmm. Women will always be women. Women will always shoot themselves in the leg. She refused to give me what I wanted that day. She made me chase after her for a whole month. And finally when it happened, was there. Listen, women, not every man appreciates being dragged. You do that to us, we play along until we get what we want, and the moment we get it, once again, we'll be gone like the wind. <laughs> <laughs> now, Martin's face is like that. Martin, I mean, why Martin face strong like that? Martin. Why is your face like this? Do you guys think this is funny, Abby? But it's funny, now. It's funny. My brother, wait, wait. We're just catching fun, aren't we? What fun? 
It's not your sister you go like her. Ah, what is why they mention his sister name now? See, as you tell the as you tell the angry with me now, eh? Now so those girls they feel her can't they mess them up. You guys should stop now. You're messing people's feelings up. My man. Ah. Now women they be. They woke up and said it is now women's world. So they get what they deserve. Oh really? I see. So this is what you people want to be doing, Abi. Can I ask you that? What do you guys change? What do you gain from these things that you're doing? You guys should change now. We don't go. We don't come up for school now. We don't be mad. Matthias, why did they carry this matter for her? They, they read. Now show all those girls in beer. See, girls treat guys like trash. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> tell him or tell him. It depends <laughs> on the kind of girl. I think they talk up. Depends on the kind of girl. These are women business. They do their own daily business. They go. Huh? See, how do you feel that contract you want to get? See, somebody just mess them up for you. When you call a girl, you pay her, you do her business and let her go. Now you're messing her business up. Why? Why do they do like this now? I'm gonna change. I'm gonna look for a girl with a beefy on her status now. Okay, what kind of nonsense is this guy? Why would they do all this? Calm, calm down. I can't, I never reach like this. You can't shout. Relax. Yeah, relax. Listen. Listen. We're just being boys. You understand what I'm saying? Like, you know, <laughs> boys will be boys. Uh-huh. And boys must play. Hey, now <laughs> you know, so we're trying to. You used to play too way back in campus yes. before you joined the uh, you know, scripture you know. See, 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 see Martin too. Martin. That was then. And I realized that what we were doing was wrong. It was wrong. And what I did, I changed. I found my part, I changed. Oh boy, don't clean up, you know, go, you know, you know, you know, you know, follow the right path. Well, I don't want to follow the right path. It depends on the girl. Where the better girl? Where the better girl, my brother? Where are the good girls? Where are the good girls? We can't see them. So, so you think that makes you a man, Abi? Do you guys want to be playing? Okay. Not for me, I'm, not, I'm done playing. I'm not anymore. I'm out. Okay? I'm out. I found somebody that I love, that completes me, that's amazing, that makes me feel like a, like a man. This man is no good here, no good here, no good here. See, that young woman, see, we all know her past things. So don't even go there. Hey. See, whatever my girlfriend had done in the past, that's her past. It's boxed up. I'm monkey past, but I'm not going back to open it. See, what happens is the contemporary affection that I have for her, the loving and understanding we have for each other, that's what matters. And Mr. Perfect that wants to marry an angel, how sure are we that they didn't even punch the woman? Punch and wear, go even to we up. See, guy, a word is not for the wise, oh. And the message today is for you guys to change, okay? I've changed, it's, it's going well for me, and you guys should change, but I don't work out. I don't get it. Seriously, I don't get why people think that they can live their lives and that of others. Really? Now let me ask you, how is it even possible for a man to stick to just one woman? I don't agree. A man can, if a man sticks to one woman, then who then takes care of the deficit? Millions of excess left to be looked after. Who? Ask me. Someone has to look after them. Oh yeah. Don't kill a man now for trying to have more than one. <laughs> I want to live my life the way I want it. I want me to flex my life the way I feel it. Ooh, I have enjoyed my life. Ah. Ooh. I have tasted salt and sugar in this lifetime. Oh yes, I tell you that. For I have never failed to get any kind of woman that I have desired. Truly. <laughs> I love my life. Mama, how are you? Ten. I have a woman. 
Is this you? Yes, yeah, so live on direct. <laughs> hey! Hey! Oh my eyes, Papa! Papa! Your father went to visit Ichie Okachi. He will soon be back. I got some stuff as usual. You remember the last time I came? Hey! There was something you begged me. Uh, you said I should get for you. I know you thought I forgot. <laughs> oh, hey, we'll see my hey. son. Uh, you have your goosey feeling. Mama, how are you? I'm fine. You look well. Kenneth. Mommy. So this is you. <laughs> At least you wait for a small time. Uh -huh. I wait for the food you're making. I can see you're about to make a goosey uh, soup. Else you will not taste this delicious <laughs> soup. I will taste it, Baba. <laughs> uh, Baba, you look well. How are you? I'm fine. Kenneth. For this, for this girls, there's no one you call and the person will just pick up. Eh? At least when I leave here now, I'm supposed to at least hook up with somebody. Matter, my son. Hey, hey, mom, you startled me. Uh, it, it's network, oh. it's um, mobile internet. Okay, so yeah. you want to call? No, <laughs> mom, it's mobile internet, like internet that you know you have on your device, on your phone. Mm -hmm. So you can use it to get on the soft day. Oh, mom, you won't understand, don't worry. You know, I'm trying to keep myself busy. You know, it can be very boring without internet, especially this. Says who? How did you survive all these years growing up? There was no phone then. Yeah, well, that was back in the days, Mom. The world has changed, you know. The world is advanced now, and part of that advancement. Hey, you children of these days, you just like complaining all the time. Not complaining, Mom. There's no, there's no service. There's no... Connection here is terrible. <laughs> can't even, can't do anything. I can't reach anybody. I have to, uh, at least I have to be in touch with, you know, with town so that, you know, I don't know how long, how long would it take Papa to get here? I have to go. Kenneth. Mom. You need to start resting. This is your father's house and nothing is pursuing you from here. Yes, your father will surely return. I'm resting, man. When was the last time you visited us? Not too long ago now. You should think of spending the night here. What? Ah, no. I have to get back to town, Mom. I have to work now. Eh? Is that not how I take care of you and Dad? I have to work. Hmm. I'm shocked that you will say that you take care of us. When was the last time you sent anything to us? Mom, how, how can you say that? I sent you stuff now. I even just got here and I, and I, and I bought you stuff. Eh? Your two hands were heavy. Kenneth. You have denied me now, now, now. Kenneth, you need to brace up in life. How about... Hey, the revelation I had of you a few days ago was very bad. You had a revelation? And now that you are here, you should hear it. I don't understand. What kind of dream is this now? Have you been discussing with somebody in this community? Uh, uh, who? No, tell me, who have you been discussing me with? Because I, I cannot understand. Why would you have that kind of dream? Nobody. Look at you. Who and who do you mix with in this community? How many people know you? How many friends do you have? Nobody told me anything. It was revealed to me by the Spirit. If you like, accept it. If you like, ignore it. <laughs> That is not the problem. Mama, please tell me the dream again. You, you said that you saw me wearing a white garment. And then a woman... No, that I was running with a white garment. And then a woman with the power of 100 women was trying to pull me back with a long robe. A woman with the power of 100 women. 
trying to pull me back. Don't me. just regard it as a dream. Regard it as something that was revealed to me by the spirits. I understand that, but why would they reveal that kind of a thing to you? Like, I'm wearing a white garment. What is the significance of the white garment? And then you say that this woman, the woman that was trying to pull me back with the long mm. rope, was also holding um, a, 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 a container filled with black liquid, mm. trying to pour it on my white garment. Yes. Hi. That is to tell you that your chi does not agree with you and the way you live your life. What, what did I do to my chi? How did I offend my chi? If my chi was here, I'll ask him. I don't understand. Kenneth, how many times have your father and I warned you about women? No, 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 not now, no, not now, not now. You don't seem to realize that women are not ordinary. You don't even know the power an ordinary woman carries. Sit down there and be asking me stupid questions. Ah, Baba. You're back. Uh -huh. oh, you're, you're welcome. Thank you. So you have come? Uh, yes, well, I've been here for some time now. When did you come? Oh, this afternoon. I've been here since... Uh, Mm. Well, have you told him? Mm. That's what we were just discussing. Oh. Kenneth. Papa. How old are you now? 35. 35? Yes. Good. Which means you know you are no longer a baby, but an adult. Yes. Good. So, when are you bringing a woman home to introduce to us as your wife? Papa, I did not hear what you said. You did not hear what? I did not hear what you said. You did not hear what I said? Kenneth, this was how you were telling me soon, 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 when I asked you to start building your house next to mine. Whoa. Kenneth, what is your problem? What is wrong with you? Now, do you know where I'm coming from? Uh, Mama told me that you, you went to see Ichi Okato. Yes. Exactly. Ichi Okato, the great seer, the deep seer. The things he told me I enough to write a book about you for generations. You are destined to be a great man by reason of the star you came into this world with. But your love for women, sorry, will not allow your star to shine. Kenneth, what is your problem? What is wrong with you? What exactly are you looking for, Kenneth? Well, don't judge me. Don't, don't even judge. Listen, man, I try, okay? I try. Oh, yes, I know I try. I try. Even when I try, you know, to be godly. Even when I try to be heavenly, these women would let me. Well, you know I have issues with my waist. Please. Ten. Ten. Yeah, what they say is enough for the wise. Can. Hmm. Uh, every day for the thief, one day is going to be for the owner. Can. Can. Today is a good day to repent. Today will be a good day to make a turnaround in your life so that you do not fall a victim of your own cunning act, Ken. Just, just look, look at your life. Eh? Just what if? What if this girl raised alarm against you? And people came rushing to attack you, Ken. Think of your life. And make it all around.
You are highly lifted up. There is no one like you. Halle, 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 hallelujah. Yeah, yes, you are highly lifted up. There is no one like you, Lord. Halle, 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 hallelujah. Yes, you are wonderful. You are worthy, O oh Lord. You are wonderful. You are worthy, O oh Lord. Hosanna, Hosanna. Blessed be the name of my Lord. Hosanna. Hosanna, Hosanna. Blessed be the name of the Lord. My God and my Father, you are the one that created me and put me in this world. And you know that I love you. You know that I try, God. I try. But it's just this weakness that I have. Heavenly Father, the maker of heaven and earth, I have come to you today to help me fight this weakness before this weakness begins to fight me. Father, please, I have the weakness of the waste. The weakness of the waste. You say that as we dare to declare and decree, so shall it be. Father, I stand upon your name and authority right now to declare that every weakness around my waist is hereby removed in the mighty name of Jesus. Everything that likes to make me get attracted to the opposite waste, Father, please, let not this waste deny me of your favor, your love. Hey. Say the marvelous love, you cannot tempt me. Father, King of glory, please. As I am praying to you, the temptations are coming through. But Father, I am steadfast in my, in my belief in your name, Jehovah. I ask that your altar begin to rise above the altars of these girls calling me and tempting me. Father, King of glory, who prevents that one night is calling. Jehovah, King of glory, as I am talking to you, they can see me in their coven and they are calling. And I am saying, Jehovah, Help me, strengthen me not to pick this call. Father, even as I am tempted to pick this call, Lord Jesus, who prevents a one night, you will not have me. You shall not weaken my waist. You shall not get me. You shall not get me. I will not fall into this temptation. Neither shall I fall into this pit. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I rebuke you. I rebuke the phone call. Why is it that I cannot reach any of these girls? Eh? What is this? Chama Bolas Club that you know that once you just call once, she will even pick and call you with her second number. No, no, this is not fair. I'm, 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 I'm alone. Huh? My tank is full. Who could vents a one night stand? That one, the number you have called is, is, is switched off. How do you go to the book here?
please let me be able to reach one person. Just one person. I'm still a single guy. Eh? I told you that I have a bad habit. But that does not mean you're supposed to take all the women out. At least you leave one that I'll use to hold my side. God, they don't used to answer prayer like this. Please now, don't make me tell you to respect yourself. MTN number you have dialed is currently switched off. The number you have called is switched off. For what? And this one, this one, you're just quiet. I don't understand. What's the problem? A guy. We have been talking to this guy since, and he's not answering. Forget about this man now. Uh, but no, they talk like that. No, no, they talk like that. Now, now Ken, who they talk about here? Oh. Please, Ken. Yeah. See, Ken. Please, what's wrong with you? See, do you know we've been we've been calling you? You're not picking your call. We almost thought something might have happened to you. Yo, Jokes, can't you see the young man wants to be alone? I mean, give him some space now. He's an adult, he can figure himself out. <laughs> okay, well, if you say so, I think that's the best thing to do. Well, guys, man, what are we still doing now? Let's, let's give him some space. Now. Hello? Okay? Okay, sir. Okay. I'm coming, sir. I'm coming. I'm coming, sir. Sir? Um... Namdi. Sir? I called you here because I want to... give you some strict instructions. Hmm? Yes, sir. Um, for now, no one is allowed to walk through that gate without my consent. The gate, sir? Oh, yes, the gate. Even if the person says they know me, come and confirm with me. Okay, sir. First. Okay, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. These people <laughs> now the man is angry. Our guy is angry, very angry. Is it nobody should go? Ah, who, who, who is this one again? Yeah, our guy has said, I don't want anybody to pass through this gate again. Right now, after giving the social, somebody's knocking. Knock him, bam, bam, bam. But I don't understand this thing. Yeah? Who is that? Who is that? Hold on, I'm coming. Eh? Wait. You want to break down this gate? Uh huh. Okay, just hold on. Hold on, I'm coming. Eh? Hold on, let me tell him. Hold on. Huh? Ah. Uh, uh, there's somebody at the gate that uh, wants to see you. Alright, who? Okay. Uh, oh, where are you going to? No, how did you come in here? I'm talking about you're, you're, you're moving. What is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of what? How did you come in here? How did you. I locked that gate. How did you get in here? Through your nose. 
Excuse me. Don't, 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 don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Ken, can you tell this stupid old man to stop Wait. harassing me? Oh, you are calling me stupid. Your father is stupid. Your grandfather is stupid. Your great great grandfather is stupid. In fact, all of your generation is stupid. Are you mad? Please, yes. no, 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 excuse oh me. Don't, 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 don't try that. Ken, what is this? Can you tell this man to get out? Get out, get out where? No, no, okay, okay, Ken, your son. Okay, Namdi. Sir. Uh, let her through. Excuse me, sir. This girl undermined my security, intelligence, and apparatus. I will throw her out. I understand. Yeah? Namdi. Please, get, get out. Yeah, 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 get out. Look at her. Why is your gate man preventing me from seeing you? Uh, listen, a lot um, has happened uh, lately. Plus, I have a lot on my mind right now. A lot has happened. Are you okay, though? How did you find this place? <clears throat> well, I asked Chooks for your address. Chooks? Chooks. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, so why are you here? Why? What kind of a question is that? I'm just asking. <laughs> Ken, I haven't seen you like in forever. And you're acting like I'm bothering you. I mean, didn't you miss me? Hmm? I missed you. Okay, can you at least tell me why you're here? I'm here because I missed you. And I know you missed me too. Um, didn't you miss this? Chama. Ken. Chama. I missed you. Mm. It's been such a long time. Mm. No, don't, don't do this, Chama. I know you like it. Stop. Oh. Could you just stop? Allow me to live my life the way I want it. Allow me to flex my life the way I feel it. You left me all alone. You are awake, eh? Mm-hmm. Oh. What's wrong? Just have a lot on my mind. Oh, a lot on your mind? You've been saying this since I came. I mean, it's not time you open up yet. Ken, I hope it's not because I came here unannounced that you're acting up like this. I hope you're not broke, though. Why? Are you? you should suck that that idiot that calls himself your gate man. Why would you call him an idiot? That man is old enough to be your father. I don't care. I don't like him. He's so annoying. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll do something about him. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, Choma, one more thing. Next time you want to visit me, will you be kind enough to let me know before you show up here? Just so you don't come here and I'm not home. Oh, of course. I'll call you. And thank you for the cash. 
You're so nice. <laughs> All right. See you next time. Bye. Adios. <laughs>
stressing me out. Allow me to live my life the way I want it. Allow me to flex my life the way I feel it. Take it easy, cause you don't know tomorrow. Cause you don't know tomorrow. I beg, I beg. Yeah! Ha ha! Who's in my house? There's nobody in the house. What? There's somebody in my house. Ah, there's nobody there. Nobody goes in here without my knowledge. What are you talking about? There's somebody in my... Are you sure you did not let somebody into this house when I wasn't away? Sir, I don't, I don't, don't ever do that. Nobody comes in here when you, when you are away. Nobody. Nobody. I know what I saw. It's I saw something. I saw somebody in my house. It's not possible. Sir. Nandi. It's not possible. Are you sure you were not sleeping and left the... Gate open and somebody sneaked into my house. I have somebody in my house. Me sleep on duty is not possible. But you sleep on duty, don't you? Look, I have a woman in my house cooking in my kitchen. In the kitchen. Yes, how did she get in here? It's not possible, sir. It is possible. I know what I saw. A ah, person, human being, in the house. When you are not, no, it's not. It's not possible. My God, it's not possible. I have a spirit in my house. Spirit, sir. Yes. No, 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 no. Okay. No, no, no. no. It, it has to be a spirit. Let if you are saying you don't let anybody in and there's somebody in my house cooking, and, uh, uh, and like, that's the spirit. Sir. Let me see. Let me see with my eyes. Stop it. Be in front. Be in front! What? What? Wait, wait, wait. You said there's nobody. Ken, stop playing hide and seek and come here and sit down and eat. <laughs> How does she know we are here? She called my name. She called your name. How does she know we are here? She wants to call your name. You better so hurry up because the food is going to get cold.
serious. Come and eat. Hey. You tell that person that was hiding there that you come and tell her to go. She can see you. She said she come in. How did you how did you get? You met her and looked for you, right? Mm, mm, mm. Sit down and I'll tell you. Okay. Sit down! Okay. Okay, ma. Okay. Ah, what's wrong with you? Please don't kill me. Please don't, please don't kill me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> so you really thought you could play the fast one on me? I'm sorry. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I'm sorry. Oh, shut up. Shut up. Just shut, shut it. Shut it. Okay. Just shut up. I'll give you money. I'll give you money. I'll give you money. I'll give you money. You also think that I came all the way looking for you because of your money? <laughs> How many people have you done this to, Ken? Tell me. How many? How many? I can't remember. Five? Ten? Twenty? One hundred? How many people? I'm sorry, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Please, please. Eat. <laughs> I'm scared, I'm scared. You're scaring me. I can't eat. I'm, I'm not scared. here to harm you, Ken. Trust me, I'm not here to harm you. I'm scared, I'm scared. I don't want to experience the kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. I don't want to die. I will repent. Uh, the gate. Somebody at the gate. Yeah? Come on, 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 I'm scared to be a ghost. I'm scared to be a ghost. I'm scared to be a ghost. Just in case you think it's poisoned. It's not. I'm not a ghost. You look like a ghost! Hey! Oga has finally entered one chance. Has finally slept with mommy water. Hey! How on earth is he going to survive this? <sighs> okay. I know what to do. I'll just pack my things and be ready. Of course, I'm close to the gate. Once the spirit woman starts anything, huh? What? I warned you. I warned you. Never listen to me. Hey! KKCGJ.
really? Like seriously? You own this whole place, this whole beautiful sitting room, and all you do is just stand at a corner. Hey. Eh? What are you doing standing when you have the whole of this space to yourself? Please. So you know that I'm here? How did you see me? Hi. Um. Okay. Um. Hi. What is it? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Hi. <laughs> Gift, gift. <laughs> gift, gift. <laughs> hey, I like this, your phone. <laughs> yes. <laughs> ah! Thank you. Uh, hey, can. Uh, 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 sorry, ma, ma, can I sit down, ma? This is our sitting room. This is our chair. So feel free. Sit down wherever you want to sit down. Please stop. that has all the beautiful qualities that other women are praying for. The one who went all out to give it to me yesterday. Gift. Special gift. Uh, uh, this is your fine phone. Uh, do you have your account number inside so you can give it to me, please? Account number for what? Oh, I want to send you something. I want to just appreciate you. I don't you. need it. But you have to need it too. You heard me. What do I need your money for? I don't need your money. Well, why? Because I don't need it. What do I need your money for? You just think I'm one of those babes, yeah? Hmm? Those those call girls that you pick about. Hi. No, now. Hi. Special gifty. No. Hi. Yeah. You're just making excuses. Because you were actually thinking that I'm one of those girls that you'll be, you'll be carrying about the place. I'm here to let you know that I'm not that kind of person. It's simple. You're tormenting me, oh. You are tormenting me. Did I say you're a cool girl? Look at you. You're tormenting me. How am I tormenting you? How you not tormenting me? You showed up in my house. I'm scared. You're scaring me. You tormented me. I did I give you my address? No. No, 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 no. I did not give you my address. You don't even have my phone number. And I just come back. Vim. You're here. And you're saying you're not tormenting me. You're tormenting me. You have to go. You really have to go. Go now! Hey! God, she's not saying anything though. God, what have I done? Absolutely nothing. do nothing. We have now become one. I'm here to stay. I'm not going anywhere. What? What? No, 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 no. Over my dead body, me and you are... No, 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 we are not one, no. We are not one. Me and you, we are two separate people from two different worlds. You need to be careful. You just go about treating people anyhow you like. You go about sleeping with random girls at will. Huh? What did I do to you? We had sex now. And in the process, I did not hurt you. You did not hurt me. You enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. And now I'm saying, let me transfer you money so that you can go. And you're saying that you're not going. You have to go. This place cannot contain me and the spirit, oh. You have to go back to your world. You don't, you don't belong. You don't belong. Hey, Ken. Ken, 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 I'm finished. I'm finished. Hi. I can't, can't, can't see what you have done to yourself. I, I, I've lived a very wrong life. 
はい。はい。はい。いやいやいや。はい。あ、うん。はい。はい。How I wish I had done things differently. What, what, what is this now? Huh? What? <laughs> Namdi, if you're here to tell me that Oga, I told you so, don't even do that. I already know. I already know. And I'm dealing with it. That is not the case. Now, why are you here? Don't be here, okay? I know that I have lived a wrong life and I'm regretting it. So just let me do that in peace right now. Please, let me do it in peace. Please. You see, men who are men to not allow problems to kill them. No. Huh. Not this kind of problem. Listen, they find a way always to solve the problem. Mm, this one is beyond the wisdom of an old man and Namdi. You it will not understand what I have done. Hi. 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 Namdi. Hi. You won't understand. Hello. Hi, sorry to bother you. Actually, my name is Ken and, and that's my car. I, I had a bit of a situation with them, uh, but they told me, you know, that a good Samaritan helped me out. You know, the thing is, I, I didn't come with cash and usually I, I, I use my card, but I, I, I forgot my card. I left it in my wallet, on top of my dining table, at home. And I was asking them, okay, let me do transfer. I don't know, no, no, it's against their policy. I was a bit trapped, given the fact that I'm rushing, you know, I'm going somewhere. So, you know, I'm, I'm just here to say thank you. Thank you too. It, it's it's hard to you know find good people these days. You know it's it's really really hard. Don't worry, I've done what I have to do. Yeah. So thank take care. you so much. I mean, it would have been a mess. I mean, if you're given the fact that I'm rushing, so but goodness me, you look good. Thank you. I owe you one. Thank you so much. Oh boy. Woo! That's an angel in human skin. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Uh, hi. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening. Okay, you don't remember me? No, I don't. Uh, oh, do what? I know you? What? <laughs> you don't remember me? No. Oh my goodness. Just a few hours ago. At the petrol station. Petrol station? A young man. Then... Had that had an issue with his card, bought petrol in my car, oh. POS wasn't working, you know, you oh. had to talk to the manager on my behalf to, you know, let me off. Yes, that was a concluded business, so I, I don't need anything from you again. Um, 
I'm not saying you need something from me. I, you know, I it's it's a coincidence that I'm 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 running to you again the second time in okay. one day. Okay. I was actually, you know, I was rushing somewhere. Actually, oh yeah, I was rushing somewhere. I was running, you know, to catch up with a meeting. Mm -hmm. Good news is I got the deal. Oh yes, I Congratulations, got that's good to know. Thank you. And I owe it to your benevolence, you know. Oh, please don't 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 thank me, honestly. If you want to pay back, just <laughs> give it to charity. I'm fine. Charity. Sounds good. Yeah. Sounds really, really good. That's different, but good. It, but before we get to that point, can I at least appreciate you? I don't need anything from you. For please. starters, can I take you where you're going? So no no no, don't worry. I just ordered my ride, so you, you should be here any moment from now. Come on, I don't you can know cancel. Why. I order rides sometimes too, and I cancel when I get help. You know, like this kind of help. I was going to say we do lunch, you know, in appreciation for what you did for me today, but I feel that that would be me asking too much and being a bit too forward. I don't know. Come on, please. Huh? I won't take no for an answer. I don't know if you have noticed, I... Noticed about what? Looking for a way to ask you again. Ask me about what? A very pretty woman like you definitely would have... a mind-blowing name, a name that goes with her looks. And I'll be happy if... Uh, giving the opportunity to hear it, you know, come on. What exactly is your interest? Friendship. You have already shown how angelic you can be. I ask that I'll, I'll be given a chance to get close to you, be your friend. I'll appreciate it. That's my interest. It's gift. What's gift? The name is gift. Oh wow. Gift? Yeah. I knew it. What? Gift? <laughs> you are a gift. <laughs> you have been nothing short of a gift to me today. I think I'm now in trouble for telling you my name. Why would you say that? You're not in trouble. I'm having a good time spending this time with you. As a matter of fact, I brought you here so that we can have a moment. A moment? Yeah, a special moment. Look, I honestly don't know what you're... I'm thinking, I don't know what all of this arrangement is all about, but if it's what I'm thinking, I want to announce to you that I'm unavailable. <laughs> oh boy, you remind me of me. Plain, simple and direct, you know. <laughs> I appreciate it. Women like you are rare. You just blot it out. As it is. I'm pretty much serious about it. I'm not <laughs> available for you. It's okay, I just want to be your friend, really. <laughs> so, do you come here often? Why do you ask? Nothing, you just seem so relaxed and um, pretty much familiar with everybody. Well, yes, I come here. I come here to relax. Oh, interesting. Yeah. For the company or on a company? What would you like? Would I tell you the truth? I will lie to you. You're not saying anything. <laughs> I come here sometimes so, with company to relax. Ah, at least you didn't deny that. Oof, how can I deny Lagos traffic? How can I deny that it's a perfect place 
to kill traffic time, especially when you have good company. I tell you what, they have beautiful hotel rooms here. So depending on the company, depending on the chemistry that you have with that company, the two of you can decide to go upstairs and have a special room. Look at you, everything about you just smells sex. Really? <laughs> I don't know if to be embarrassed, but it's okay. I just know I have never said that to you before. Come on. You don't have to say it, woman. I look at you, you know, it's written everywhere. I do realize that if I have to do that with you, it means I've really come to like you very much as a person. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you. This means a lot. You have no idea how much you have touched my soul and spirit. But I tell you this, if ever you allow me to have it, I vow to you to be on the sacredness of your womanhood that I will never take it for granted. I am going to cherish it for the rest you know, of my life. Sometimes I really wonder if you do understand the meaning of what you say. Oh yes, I understand every word. That comes out of my mouth. I might not know so much, but I know that a woman like you is one that any man should be privileged to have and <laughs> cherish forever. And uh, you know, you said the nicest of things, and you know, these few weeks we've spent together have really, really come to cherish you so much. So. So much. <laughs> I have come to know a lot about you. Oh yes, I know that you have um, a few challenges here and there, which is why you invest a lot in charity. Did you let me into your world. I did. Yes, you did. And I tell you this, I am never going to take that. Okay. You know what? I'm going to um, I'm going to give you some amount of money, not to impress you, but to show you that for real, charity work truly pays. You are? Yes. Oh my goodness! Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. So much. I can't remember the last time I did this. Um, please don't let me regret it. I vow to you on my own. You're never going to regret this. You are one in a million. And I promise you today that I would always I always love you. I had the chance. Oh. Namdi, I had the chance. I had the chance. I had the chance to do everything right. Hey, with this lady. But I spot everything. She was an angel from the word go. Look, from the moment I met, can she hear me? Hey, Namdi. Namdi, this is my fault. Hey. From the moment I met her, she was an angel. She was an angel. I should have just behaved myself and do things right. Hi. See, the important thing is that now you know she's not a spirit. You feel that thing can be fixed? Who told you she's not a spirit? She's not a spirit. She's not, she's not a spirit. Why are we whispering? She is not a spirit. Fix things for now.
my king. Vincent! What is wrong with you? You have been behaving strange since yesterday. Like you're engaging me in a cold war. And I don't understand. Because it's affecting me as a wife. Please, I want to know. What did I do? What did you tell my mom? Your mom? Oh. I didn't say anything damaging against you. I didn't say that. But were you not the same person I told about Ichi Ejindo, that he is an enemy? So, why must you go to my mother to discuss whatever nonsense he said about me? Honestly, my dear husband, that is where you are missing it. That man is not an enemy. Are you detecting for me? I am not detecting to you. But you have continued to shut me down. And I don't know why. Yeah, man. I did not shut you down. But you are beginning to cross your boundary. Vicent, are you not supposed to be a father already? As a king who rules over a land, should you not have an heir already? Tell me. And that's one who is married to that king. Are you not supposed to have given him an heir? Vincent, I cannot give you an heir because there is something in your past that is preventing that from happening. Who told you that? Is it not the same Ichi Jindo? Why are you still listening to that man? Vincent, is there something you did that has angered the gods? Can't you face it? Because that is the only reason we are here agonizing. Rise up like a man that you are and face it. There is nothing wrong about my past. Let this be the last time you say a thing like this. No! No. I'm going to struggle with my sleep. No. Strong. What makes you think I wouldn't have done that earlier if that was my intent? You scared me! You scared me! Scaring you how? I'll just go to the guest room. Let me go to the guest room. Let me go to the guest room. I'll go to the guest room. Let's see. What did you do? I kissed you so. Ah! Don't kiss me again! Don't do that! Don't kiss me. The hotel you took me to. We did more than kissing. You've uh, forgotten? Uh, 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 I did that with a human being, but not a spirit. The one that came to my house. You. That Please, came to my you, house. Would you, would you just calm down and stop all of this? How many times would I tell you I'm not a spirit? Yes, spirit. Your mind is playing games. Yes, spirit. 
They came to my house without my address. Stop being childish. Yes, spirit. If you're not a spirit, how did you come here? How did you find me? If you embrace up, I'll tell you the whole story. Start talking, start talking. At least you can talk. Start talking. I want to know. I need to know. Stop, stop talking. I'm scared. I'm confused. Start talking. Okay. How did you find me? I once fell in love with a guy. And everything didn't turn out as I expected. I have lost count of too many meetings. I've been summoned. And the only agenda is Vincent, get married. Vincent, my prince. <laughs> I must confess, there is something unique about the lady you brought. Uh, Vincent, as you can see, your father and I are curious as who you came to show us. Well, the wait is over. Her name is Kit. The one who showed me qualities I never saw in other. Huh? I have decided to make her my wife. Wow. That's it. good. That's my song. <laughs> mm. You're welcome, my daughter. You're welcome. Your majesty. Oh. You're welcome, my daughter. Thank welcome. you so much. You're welcome. Thank you so much. You're welcome, my daughter. My prince. You're welcome. Is this an approval from the royal head? Sure. Why shouldn't we approve the excellent choice you have made? Eh? We've been waiting for this. Oh, that's why. <laughs> yes. Eh? You're welcome, once again, You're welcome. Thank you, my daughter. You're welcome, my daughter. We've been waiting for this. You are looking at her as if you don't like her. She's already married into this royal family. She's now a princess. Your Majesty, you know me very well. I'm like a crab that cannot be eaten in secret. What I will tell you now is the mind of many men in council. The speed with which you married her is strange. It's a gentle. Just look at the woman we're talking about. Have you seen her? Hmm? She brought royalty into royalty. This kind of woman is hard to find. And when we see women made in the mode of kings, we don't waste time. We just go ahead and marry them. Immediately! <laughs> Your Majesty, how can you look at me and say I brought royalty into royalty? I'm a nobody, Your Majesty, sir. The way I looked that day was how Vincent wanted me to look. He bought everything I wore. I have never been adorned in such a beautiful outfit ever in my life. Please, Your Majesty, I'm just an ordinary street girl. Calm down, my daughter. My qualifications of you has nothing to do with your physical appearance. It is rooted deeply in you. Just have it in mind that you are loved. Well, my daughter. Thank you so much. Well, Thank you so much. Good. Thank you, sir. So, you see, Your Majesty, I like her sincerity and humility. Mm. It's difficult to see beauty and humility blended. Mm. It's rare. <laughs> I think you are right <laughs> about your uh, assessment. It's okay, my daughter. <laughs> Just retire back to the chambers. Thank you, sir. <laughs> hey, did you? Ah, yes. the very song that rises in the palace. Yes, my prince. The one I choose 
for myself. How did the meeting go with the king? Mm, it wasn't a meeting per se. But I know that there's one that was sitting down there that was very intimidating. I know him. You do? Ichi Ejindo. I think so. The fourth in council. Ah. His decisions are tough. What did he say? Well, he exhibited that tough side of him. But he later soft pedaled. And uh, the way the meeting ended, I think that I've been accepted into the royal home. Why will you say that? You see, you got accepted the very day the king blessed you as your wife in this palace. And his decisions are irrevocable. Wow. And there's nothing anyone can do about it. Oh, I'm so very happy. So happy. You're always beautiful. And you say the best things. Thank you for all that you've done. You see, the queen is even more impressed about you than the king. You know, I'm actually thinking how I got such an easy passage. I thought I'll be rejected. How could they reject a woman of your class? Is it possible? Well, thank I, you very much. No, I should for be accepting to be my woman. No, I should be thanking you for deciding to bring me here. Honestly, I, by my qualification, <laughs> I don't, I don't stand a chance. No. Greatness has nothing to do with background. It has everything to do with personal decisions. True. You see, you're a great woman today because of the great decisions you have taken in life. Thank you so much, my prince. You're welcome. Totally grateful. Thank you. You're welcome. Initially, I had my doubts because she appeared a bit older than my son. But then, I just discovered she's just an angel. Oh yes, the main fact that she kept herself a virgin, even at that age. In this era that virgins are no longer common, she still kept herself a virgin. It shows the kind of background she has. Yes. Everyone in the palace is happy for the kind of quality she brought into the royal family. I'm sure she will be happy here. Oh, yes. Everyone likes me. But there's still something weird Vincent, something strange. Is it something personal with him or is it a problem in the royal house? Does it mean that the king was waiting for me to be married into this family before he died? Why would he leave us like this? Kings do not die, my dear. They join their ancestors. His remain must be loyal today. In four days' time, we will gather to crown you king in line with the agreement we had with the king. Vincent is so weird. He is not going to make a good king. Ichi Ejindo, are we going to bury the king without trying to find out the cause of his sudden death? My queen, if someone is involved in the demise of the king of this kingdom, we leave that to the gods to handle. Ichi Ejindu, I am not happy with the verdict 
from some of the elders in council regarding my wife. What's the budget? You see, Ichi Ichi Dime is the major problem here. He said that my wife is not qualified to be the next queen because she has no royal blood. <laughs> Your Majesty, I'm surprised uh, that you're sounding as if you don't know this already. You married her because she's a beautiful woman. Perhaps she gives you the kind of pleasure you have not experienced from any other woman. And it all ends there. Even if she bears you a son, that son cannot be the king of this land. Why will you say something like that? Well, because she is not of royal blood. Because you have made her your queen does not make her a valid queen. There are many women in this kingdom that will never obey her instructions. So, what is the way forward? Mm, I suggest you retain her as your wife for the pleasure she gives you. But you have to marry another woman with the royal blood that will bear you a son that will be the king of this land when you join your ancestors. I'm not ready for this. So that's to say there is nothing we can do about this. Hmm. There are rules older than men. And when men who are men are confronted with those rules, they don't argue. They just follow the rules. Is there any sense remaining in this marriage? I mean, apart from the status of royalty, what else do I really enjoy in this marriage? Vincent has not been making love to me. It's as if he knew all this, all this while. But it just sounded as if he was hearing that for the first time. I mean, if he wasn't aware, why then has he been behaving so strangely? What are you doing here? Uh, are you okay? My lord, uh, is your meeting over? Yes. So tell me, what are you thinking of? My lord, a woman that is saddled with so much responsibility should be thinking on how not to disappoint the people, don't you think? You're right. Mm -hmm. oh, so tell me, everything that is running. On this your head. Ah, my lord, come on. My thoughts should not be your worry. You're already made king. So a woman's concerns and woman's matters and all of that shouldn't be part of your responsibility. Okay? Don't worry. I'm fine. Hmm? I'm just fine. Ah. What's wrong with you? What's the matter? You gave me the answers the other day. You see, the responsibility of leadership is so enormous. And it's beginning to make impact on me. I agree. My lord, you have not been yourself lately. You have refused to dine with me. 
You have refused to come to bed with me. Please, talk to me. What is wrong? There's nothing to worry about. And do not let anything to disturb you. You see, I have challenges. But I will overcome them all. This union is of no benefit, for it is founded on nothing. Absolutely nothing. Should I not just walk away? What are you thinking? My king. I'm thinking the same thing as you're thinking. Uneasy is the head that wears the crown. Same as you, my king. Same as you. The responsibilities that has been so enormous for the queen as well. Why does it appear to me that there are things you are hiding from me? Things like what? Like what happened last night. I came to your door yesterday and found it locked. When did that start? No, tell me. Do you really want us to talk about it? Yes. I am your husband. And I should have access to you at any time. Why did you lock me out? Because I'm beginning to feel that this whole marriage, this whole union, is making no meaning anymore. You come to me, and then you ejaculate on the ground. What is that about? We are believing God for a child. And you don't want to do what is necessary for us to have this child. I don't understand. There are so many things that I involved. So many things like, I don't understand. Are you regretting taking the decision in marrying me? Are you? You want me to give you an heir to your throne. What is all this? I don't understand. What is the matter? Please. Mother, who is there? Under no more circumstances, I won't be discussing this with you. But right now, this is tearing me apart. Don't say that, Gift. You are that woman who made my son to settle down. We have already given up on him before you came and rescued him. So you are free to tell me anything. Please, feel free. Okay, Mom. Mom, I feel your son has a problem. Something is wrong with him. Honestly. My dear, it depends on what you mean. Because I totally agree that something is wrong with him. And that is why he waited until he is 50 before picking a wife. Yes, grandmother. His age has nothing to do with this. I don't, I'm not worried about his age. So what happened? What I'm worried about is his style of intimacy. And I am beginning to feel that he belongs to an occult. But yes, Queen Mother. This is a very serious allegation. Gift, what are you talking about? Queen Mother. As a woman looking for the fruit of the womb, as a woman who is desperate to give her husband a son, would it be glorious for him to go down with her? I agree with you completely, my daughter. But it never does. But it doesn't. Wait. 
What are you trying to tell me? Are you trying to tell me that my son has never made love to you? That's not the case, Queen Mother. He does occasionally. But he ejaculates on the ground. He does it outside. So how in this world am I supposed to get pregnant? How? Wait, wait, wait. Have you tried to get any explanation from him? Oh. He doesn't want to say anything. He doesn't want to explain anything. He doesn't, does just... I, I don't know. I don't know. My daughter, thank you for bringing this to my notice. Don't worry. I will get to the root of this. I promise. Thank you, Kuma. This is why I regret the early exit of my husband. He would have sorted this out. Yeah. The enthusiasm with which you came in has totally evaporated. Your Majesty, the problem is with your son. He's acting weird and he's beginning to scare me. In his quest to become more powerful than his father, my son compromised himself. That is what is facing him now. What does that even mean? You are a woman with the wand of the mighty. A woman with aura of kings. You came with that aura. And I have given you the gift I reserved for his wife. Anything you genuinely desire, you will have it. But if my son will not see beyond his nose and discover the joy in you, Go ahead, rise above him, and discover yourself. But your majesty, sir, I already know that I will not be able to be a mother to a king. The son of my son, no matter who the mother is, will not even be the king, because he has compromised himself. Go ahead and enjoy him as your husband and king. Do not be cast over with him, for in you I have left something mightier than the mighty. But your majesty, sir. Your majesty. Your majesty. But your majesty. Your majesty. Were you dreaming? Vincent. You compromised yourself and you have deliberately refused for us to enjoy our marital bliss. What are you saying? I have been married to you now for how long, Vincent? Over a year. And each time you come to make love to me, you release it on your palm. I mean, what kind of thing is that? Do you think I'm stupid not to know what you're doing? Gift. I have warned you before, and I'm not going to warn you again. And yeah, I'm the king, and nobody questions whatever I do. You treat me like trash, Vincent. And I demand to know what my offense is. What offense have you committed that you've not told me? What? I just had a trance. Your father appeared to me and told me a lot of things about you. What sort of man are you? I'm a man among men. I am the one that father never wanted as a king. And I am one who became king against all odds. Queen, gift, I am a moving train. You need to know where to start. Moving train indeed. What sort of a man that subjects his wife to so much pain and suffering? What sort of a man that will not allow the wife to enjoy her conjugal bliss? What kind of man is that? Mind the kind of things you speak to me, woman. 
or what happens? What happens, you Belshavni son of a good man? What happens? Have you lost it completely, woman? Have you? You now call me names. You want to force me to kill you here right now. You evil. You are evil. You are evil. Wicked man. Did I even get tear? I even, how, 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 did I, how did I find myself here? What kind of man is this? A new girl was brought in as a palace maid to be of a service to the king. I didn't suspect anything then. But I later realized that they were doing everything within their power to take me out of the palace. My queen. How are you? Yes. Looking in there, won't see me. Yes, he's inside, but he's busy. He said that he wants to step aside. Ah, listen. Gift. Step aside. I want to see reason that. It's none of your business. Really? What do you mean by that? Step aside. I want to see who's in there. I said, no, you can't see. And you won't. And you don't order your husband and the king. How could you do this to me? After all that you promised me, Vincent. Uh, you see, some promises can be taken over by events. And some promises are not meant to be kept. <laughs> I am sorry. Uh, as for you, make sure no one gets close to this door. Yes, my king. Vincent! Did I get in here? What? How did you get in here? Vincent. You? You do this to me? Because of her? Okay, Vincent, even if you wanted to cheat, it has to be under my nose. Right? After everything? That hasn't answered my question. How did you get in here? Tell me. Excuse me. Maggie. This one, did she get into this place? I was told when you were brought in here that you were coming here to work as a maid. And based on what you now know of me, do you still feel I'm a maid? More reason why I brought you here for us to have this conversation. As I don't like drawing conclusions for something I'm not sure of. Who exactly are you? <laughs> Very well then. My name is Ijemma. The one who came from the lineage of kings. The one who perfectly fits into the status of the king needs as a queen. A status you do not fit in. I am trying to reconcile something here. Did Vincent marry you? <laughs> I mean, did he pay your bride price? Did he make you his wife? Well, I've been living in this palace as a wife for months now. And you were not even aware of it. <laughs> what does that tell you? That the palace is big enough to accommodate you and I. <laughs> the enthusiasm with which you came in has totally evaporated. Your Majesty, the problem is with your son. 
He's acting weird and he's beginning to scare me. In his quest to become more powerful than his father, my son compromised himself. That is what is facing him now. What does that even mean? You are a woman with the wand of the mighty. A woman with aura of kings. You came with that aura. And I have given you the gift I reserved for his wife. Anything you genuinely desire, you will have it. But if my son will not see beyond his nose and discover the joy in you, go ahead, rise above him and discover yourself. But your majesty, sir, I already know that I will not be able to be a mother to a king. The son of my son, no matter who the mother is, will not even be the king because he has compromised himself. Go ahead and enjoy him as your husband and king. Do not be cast over with him. For in you, I have left something mightier than the mighty. I am that woman with the wand of the mighty. That woman with the aura of kings. Since Vincent is so stupid enough not to realize it, I will go out there and discover who I am. No, no don't. Honestly, it's not my plans to send you away. I mean, you're unique in your own right. And I believe there is something you and I can do together here. So you don't have to go. I wish you the best of luck, my dear. I am like a star who shares the sky with no other star. And as you have come to occupy my space with me, I'll leave the space for you. Let me go out there and find the man who value me and love me for me. Good luck. So why me? No, why me? Why you what? Why me? Why, why did you choose me? Why not somebody else? Look, the way this whole thing is looking, it's like you planned everything. Yeah, it's like you planned it. I told you to forget about me, remember? After I gave you the money, I told you to use it for charity. But no, you kept coming back because you wanted to have a taste of the pudding. Now, why are you not turning around to tell me that I, I planned it, something? What did I plan? You planned it. You planned this. Because you have powers. Oh yes, you do. You have The king gave you powers. Because you got into that room. With those powers. So why did you not stop me? When I kept coming and coming and coming and coming. So you planned it. Ken, I couldn't have told you that I had powers, I had gifts. Because I don't have control over it. Yes, I don't. If I desire something from the depth of my heart, I just see it manifesting. I don't have control over it. No, my own. <sighs> if you desire something from the depth of your heart, it starts, it starts happening. What is going to happen next? Please, please, look. I, I, I'm sorry I offended you. Look, I'm just a player. I'm a playboy. I'm just playing around. Nothing serious. Please, please. Take that one million dollar and just go. Ken, I don't need your money. I don't need the money you offer to women. I have my own money. It's just that I need a man and I think I found him. Hmm? You found who? You found who, me? You have not found me. You have not found me. Oh. Oh, you have not found me. You have not. A spirit cannot find me. You, you cannot find me. I know you cannot find me. Look, I'm a player. Oh. I'm a player. I'm a player. I'm a player. A biotic woman like you does not need a man like me. Her life. What is it going to look like? Because I'm going to play. And you will catch me. If I talk like this, you catch me. I do like this, you catch me. You My catch me. My mission is to make you a better person. That's all I desire. I don't want to be a better person. I like my life like you this. You will be a better person. Hey, Trust me. I know you will.
Are you aware that a woman already married to a king can no longer marry another? In the real sense of the word, you are no longer the king. The foundation of royalty and the spiritual protection attached to it have been removed from you because you compromised yourself. I will leave you just the same way gift left you. And I promise you that I will find love the same way she has found love. What do you mean she found love? Who is feeding you with all this information? Vincent, your main problem is lack of willingness to solve your own problem. Rather, you dedicate so much energy on frivolities. Mind the kind of things you said to me. I am a woman from the lineage of kings, and you can no longer shut me down. That I accepted to marry you was because I thought I could salvage the situation. But now I know better. And so I am leaving you, and I dare you not to come looking for me. You will regret this. I promise you, you will. I am already regretting marrying you. No other regrets could be superior to that. Rise up and solve your problem, or you die a lonely man on the throne. Excuse me. She was right. I am now that lonely king without members in council. <laughs> gift, the beautiful woman loved by my father, one given to me by the girls. Where are you? Uh, Namdi. Namdi. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, I want to believe that you are joking. How is that spirit is inside there with your ga and you are sitting here now? Bana kwa na bem bem kwa kapi sina la. Eh Namdi. Wait. What do you expect me to do? Get it or come me. Go in there and stay with the spirit. Uh, you see? You see it? I am telling you that I am more professional in this business. I'm more professional. See, if I finally get a job in this estate, eh? Who are you now? Any spirit will go try to make it enter my yoga house. Mateya. Now die. Say this, they know the key spirit will be where I did. I they kill anything. Where we say spirit or mamedo or someone will say, I they kill. That's why you, let me get the job first. I'm going to take it first. Hold on. Now, because I know if I allow you, you keep blabbing and blabbing and blabbing. Eh? Let me ask you. A kafuro also no no cause also no. Is there another pekele of you at home or are you? If you don't know, that is why they call me Odinkenke Emire. Don't you hear my name? Odinkenke Emire. One. Okay. Now come to think of it. How do you come to conclusion that she's a spirit? Somebody that is inside there cooking fried rice, eating, even invited you, you. To come and join her, and you say she's a spirit. Eh? Spirit of the refried rice. Let me ask you. Spirit of the refried rice, isn't that? Instead of you go and do, do better thing for yourself, you are here. No, you banana. I go talk like parrot. Are you a parrot? Go and be useful for yourself, or be useful to, to her. Yeah, you go. In fact, let thunder when no get senior brother. Punish this your mouth. Are you mad? No, and you. Look, can you shut your top there? More can I have a parrot? You're going to ban him? Yeah? Yeah, 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 in a children estate. Yeah? With this, he come out with her. Are you not a parrot? Is it a. More can I say a compliment? Okay, okay, okay. What is it? Any, any, any. 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 That money you use to sell this info, give it to me, or you remove this info and keep it here. Now, how much are we talking about? Ego Hey, 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 
don't want to go. You have to go. Please. Just just leave, leave, leave my house, please. Look, look, I am sorry. Okay? We did not plan that this was gonna happen this way. We, we, we did not plan that you know things things would be this way. I am sorry. I have been begging you. Please. But you really think women are just cheap? Please. Uh, why are you so comfortable in my house? Our house. What? Know? Our what? This is my house. Come on now. What am I going to be doing with a bionic woman in my life? I huh? am not. I'm not a bionic woman. What's wrong with you? If you can just calm down, sit down, let's have this conversation. You will come to benefit from our meeting. Honest. Calm down. Stop, stop, stop opening your eyes like that. You're scaring me. Go sleep now, please. Leave, leave, please. I'm sorry, I'll repent, but go. Hey, she's not saying anything. She's not saying anything. Okay, talk, say something. Biba, you go run, kata kata, you go run, kitty kitty. I'm so now, he's killing you slowly. Hey, Mato, how far now? What's up, Ken? Uh, we'll see now. I'm at the usual joint. Now? Ah, uh, yes, now. I don't think it's possible. Oh, why? Why not? I'm far away. I don't think I'll make it back in time. Ah, okay. A while ago. I hope there's no problem. Nah, nah, nah. No problem. We'll see when, 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 when you get back. No, really, it's okay. Um, just let me know when you get back, okay? All right, take care, bro. All right, cheers. <laughs> Come on now, guys. This is not funny. Now. It's not funny. All right? I have my back against the wall here. Look, I called you guys out here so we can put heads together and help me out with this situation. Okay, I'm dealing with a bounty woman here. I, 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 I have a ghost in my house. <laughs> okay. From what you are saying, one need Google, one you. Huh? You are out from singlehood. Congratulations. <laughs> okay. The situation seems to be funny. One minute. Mm. Where you go carry mommy water? You don't carry mommy water. Have we had that life? No, it's been okay now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's not that I want to laugh, but <laughs> I can't just say it. Actually, yeah. Matt seems will be having the last lap right now. <laughs> he warned you, bro. He warned you. <laughs> guys, 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 please now. Let's not play the blame game now. I, I call over here. Mona, help me. I call you guys here to, to, to help me. Let's put hands together. Ken, mm -hmm. are you seriously asking us that? Of course I am serious. I'm in trouble. No, 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 no. See, Ken, it all depends on you. How? See, man, you are the man of the house. Take 
charge of your house. Take charge. How do I go about that? Listen, the woman has mystic powers. She already knows about every move that I intend to make before I make the move. Yeah, I'm my neighbor. <laughs> it's possible. It's possible I'm, she knows I'm here. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm in trouble. I'm finished. Um, okay. Dante Aguilam, you will take charge by frustrating her. Make that house a living hell for her. Just like a cold war. Your neighbors, even your gates man, no go no say what they house. It's just you and your adorable mystic woman <laughs> that will know the resort, bro. Or could you? I see woman I run. <laughs> Where did you get all that from? You, you're saying uh, I should go? Just like. Please just go and pick whatever you want to pick from the fridge and hurry up and get ready to go to the market to buy me some cocoa. Yeah. Eh? yeah. Cooking? Hey. Hey. Wait, wait. You, you eat cocoa? Yeah? What the heck? Of course I. Of course I eat cocoa. Yeah. What's I want to make soup. I want to make ulubu soup. You eat cocoa yam and you uh, ate it with a little soup. Yes. Get that? Just come and go and Hey, now I confirm you are not a spirit. Hey, spirits don't eat ede. They don't eat a little soup. Hey. Just pick up and just go to the market and buy me this, please. No, no, stop it. What's this hey. drama about? Come on. You're not a spirit. Uh, you're not a spirit. Spirits don't eat cocoyam. They don't eat olubu soup. She's not a spirit. I'm so numb, he's killing you slowly. Life in the middle. Life in the middle. Report. What happened in my absence? Huh, okay. Yeah, nothing happened though. Uh, just that uh, I just confirmed from my uh, exam in fact, I examined this woman. I did her. I uh, uh, sifted her. So I found everything, and I came to the conclusion that that woman is not a ghost. She's a, she's not a spirit. In fact, she's not what we thought she is. That is the truth. Wow. So, ah, so even this night, eh? Ha, we are going to eat. Very sweet of Olubu, Olubu soup. She just gave me this money to go to the market and buy Olubu, buy uh, oh, Roko, buy uh, 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 buy uh, that, that Azo, Okroko Azo. Nambi, Nambi, shut up. You're a fool. Huh? Oh, yes. You're an old fool. So I left this place. Instead of you to look for a way to frustrate that ghost so that she can leave the house. You stayed and you encouraged her. Okay, so now you've started running errand for a ghost. No, no, she's not a ghost. No, she's a... 
She's how you, how are you sure she's not a ghost? Ah, ghost don't eat ofolu. And she asked me to go and buy ofolu. Eh, buy ofolu. Uh, 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 azo, uh, you those wrong ones. Okay, keep, keep quiet. See your mustache like like like, like bitter leaf soup. Sorry, sir. But she's not a ghost. Hey, hey, look. The next time you try this, you're fired. The next time you try this, you are fired. Uh, 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 look, I, I hear that you're about to cook something. Look, whatever it is that you're cooking, just know that I will not be a part of it. Okay? Not interested. Oh! You one that you look ugly. one ugly The journey of the antelope and the fruit of the ugly tree. This one was four, and one but I must eat very well. Apple caraca. With Tolubu caraca, it goes well. <laughs> it goes well. I'm waiting. Yeah, I know that in a short while from now. I know you said you don't want to eat, but you see this particular delicacy, this soup, you will love it, trust me. Ken, come and eat now. Ken. Good evening, sir. Uh -huh. <laughs> Namde, how are you? Uh, uh, what do you want? Uh, um, he wants to go and pick up his food from the restaurant. I call it here, Mona, help me. What are you guys here to, to, to help me? Let's put hands together. Ken, mm -hmm. are you seriously asking us that? Of course I am serious. I'm in trouble. No, 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 no. See, Ken, it all depends on you. How? See, man, you are the man of the house. Take charge of your house. Take charge. How do I go about that? Listen, the woman has mystic powers. She already knows about every move that I intend to make before I make the move. Yeah, I'm my neighbor. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs> It's possible I'm, she knows I'm here. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm in trouble. I'm finished. Um, okay. Dante Aguilam, you will take charge by frustrating her. Make that house a living hell for her. Just like a cold war. Your neighbors, even your gates man. No go no say what the house. It's just you and your adorable mystic woman <laughs> that will know the resort, bro. Or could you? I see woman I run. Please just go to the kitchen and get your flask of soup, Thank okay? You. Thank you, ma'am. Listen, I know you're hungry. Why don't you just stop this thing you're doing? Come on! Come and join me. You you starve yourself to death. Stop punishing yourself. Stop it. 
When you're done with all of this, your food is waiting for you on the table. Thank you, sir. Look at that guy. Thank you, sir. Thank you. They go well together. They go well together. They go well together. This is good. Hmm? For the first time in a very long while. I need you to that what I can see. No luck. This is it. Now I can swear on my very life that this woman is not a spirit. No. She is not a spirit. In fact, she is sent by the gods to come and correct my yoga. All this nonsense she has been doing. Hey! Yes! I mean, who else can cook like this? Who can cook? Can a spirit cook this kind of soup? You have not told me. She is not a spirit. I don't care what my yoga thinks about it. This woman is a, a god sent. Not a spirit. This is very, very. Mm. Oh. Let, me see. Let, let me hear this man call her spirit again. In fact.
my shirt. If this is my shirt, I will not have found it where I found it. What is this? I found it on the line with the bag. You pack. found it on the line? I found this nonsense on the floor. It doesn't matter. I'll wash it again. I'll put you wash what? You wash what? I'll wash it. My own shirt. You want to wash it to wash? Wash it to wash. What? what you, you want to wash it again? No, no. You want to wash it so you can wash. It doesn't matter. No, you, use... want, you wash what? I will use the washing machine and dryer this time. To, 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 to do what? So you want to wash it so you can wash? What? What? what you want to wash it so you can, you can kill the fabric? What is your problem? Did I even ask you to wash my clothes in the first place? Did I ask you to be here? Why are you doing things for me? Did I ask you to do things for me? Did I ask for your access? That what is your problem? All of these things you're doing, this whole drama, is too frustrating. No, you're the one frustrating me. I refuse to be frustrated. Why? No, 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 touch me. Don't 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 touch me. Look, you are mine. I can't leave you. I, you, you no, 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 I, 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 I can never be yours. Please, 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 please. We, we are playing in two different realms. You are playing in the spiritual realm. I, was, I am in the physical realm with human beings. And I can't just don't, 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 don't,
I'm telling you the fact. Those people, can, those people, when they talk to you, they're not me. They say they play like you. So, <laughs> like, better than all of Wait, wait, wait. Did, did, did I tell you that she, she was once married? Yes, the girl was once married. Look, the, the, the powers that she, she has right now was given to her by her late father-in-law. Do you understand? Okay. She was married, yeah. But she got into a toxic relationship that trampled her right as a, as, as, as a woman and her life was trampled upon. What? She, why would anybody want to use that against her? She has moved on with her life. Why would anyone want to use it? Even you. You can't use that against her now. You can't use that against her. She's, she's living a good life. So just let her be. Enjoy the moment with her. I don't get your point. I'm not ready to get married now. Martin, no, 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 Martin, what, I, I, I don't understand what, I, I came to you for, for, so that we can put heads together to, to, to see how we can kick that spirit out of the house. Are you here telling me to calm, calm down for what? Look, wait, wait, you want that girl to force me into retirement? I'm still a player, I'm still, how, I still have babes to cancel, man. I, I'm still out there, you understand what I'm saying? I, I, I'm still playing, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm still playing, I'm not ready to retire. What are you talking about? Listen to me. See, we're looking at the bigger picture here. You're looking at the bitter picture here. That girl has come to actually make your life the best. Please. That girl won't, she won't turn you to money bag. She won't make way, give you break to the great way for you. Not let all these restrictions make you see say that girl will not be a better person, though. And they tell you, I mean, my friend, and they cut and they cut and give you now. And they cut and give you now. Not look at all these restrictions. Look at the better bit. That girl won't open door for you now. And then let me go feel tell you the truth. All those people, they don't, all those friends of the valley, they don't do it. No, will tell you the truth now. Ah, the better one I could give you so. Martin, you don't even know this girl. Guy, I don't need to know how to tell what she represents. I did tell you the truth. Huh? Who would digest this matter with one sunshine bobo and one nedeku? Bama! Give us one sunshine bobo and one deku. One deku for her. Me if it digest the matter well. Guy, who would drink one thing this matter well? Man. You are a wicked man. You see, the thunder will go fire you and your generation will never come. What? So, you all this. Hey! See, beautiful woman. Uh -huh. See, as someone just is a warrior. Yes. Let's see warrior. Yes. Let's see warrior. I'm going to want to know here. Thunder will go fire you. You see, they come. That's you know, if you tell me, say this woman too beautiful like this, would you want to allow your car to lose this woman? You see, trouble though. Wait. What? The woman and my other wife. And my organ will lose up. That's why I said here. Two. What is your business there? What should I tell you? No, what should I tell you? What's your business? Come on. See, see, see listen to me. Uh -huh. Listen very carefully. Uh -huh. You are my friend. Uh -huh. Just as an advice. Eh? Don't allow this woman or allow your organ to lose this woman. As I'm telling you as a friend now. See, you see that, that woman? Since I was born, eh, I never see the beautiful woman like this woman. I never see her since I was born. I never see her. Hey! She's the most beautiful woman. And then she's the most beautiful woman according to you. But I will forgive you because you are making a mistake. And the mistake you are making is because you have not seen my wife. When you see my wife, then you know that there is a beauty somewhere. Yeah. See, that's the yeah. most beautiful as. Not be that your woman. Not be that your woman. That thing where you marry. That thing where they for village. Where, where you first be like a rock, like your own too. Yeah. Not, be, not be that your wife. Yeah. Wait, now my wife is a come back. Are you, are you, are you, are you mad? You did the first. They come and come back. I come. Leave, 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 leave me now. Turn on here. Yeah. Yeah. I will not do. Are you? Are you mad? I will not. Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Eh? I will. I will kill you. Yeah. I will. I will deal with you. No time. I will kill you. You will not kill me. I will not die. Stop. Stop that. Immediately. Nandi. Stop it. What's wrong with both of you? Two grown men fighting? Is it not this idiot? This nonsensical nonsense. Who cannot even 
pay back the money he borrowed from me. Uh, here is the cost of the fight. Did you borrow money from him? Uh, um, uh, I, I, I owe him true, I know. Uh, I know I owe him and I promise to pay him back. But you see this uniform I'm wearing? I'm looking for a job and I know that if I get the job and if they pay me, I'll pay him. Hmm. No, he insulted my wife. You insulted his wife? This is not insulting my wife. Eh? What right have you to insult my wife? Are you mad? Eh? Oh, my little... Wait, wait. You borrowed money from him. And you insulted his wife on top of it. Imagine. No, I did not insult his wife. Eh? I, I, I only said the truth. If you see the wife, you know that the, the wife is an oracle in eh? our village. Eh? Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. You saw my wife. Don't worry. I will kill you next time I, I, I lay my hands on you. Ah! You, on my time. I... It's quite, um, I'm happy that you're able to fight for your wife, to defend her. Thank you, ma. That's impressive. See me inside. Now. I will, ma. See the angel that gave herself to my yoga. And the man is Mr. Behaving. Mr. Behaving, yes? When a woman does it, it's misbehaving. The man does it, it's Mr. Behaving. The man is Mr. Behaving. It's usual. Imagine. Let me see her. He is Mr. Behaving. I'm sorry for what just happened there. That fool had no right to make reference to my wife. Ah, huh? What's wrong with him? I understand, Nandik. I mean, I'm even impressed to see that you're fighting over your spouse. So. Huh, why not? Oh, Marie Cham. Hey! Why not? Quite impressive. I like it. Hey, well you. done. Thank you, man. Sit. I'd like you to sit. I want to talk to you. See, I'm a trained security personnel. <laughs> I like to stand. <laughs> I always stand. I know. I know. What I want to talk to you about does not require you standing. It's very serious. Hmm? I'm just a good man. <laughs> Even my yoga has not done this before. Mm -hmm. That is your yoga. This is your madam. Two separate entities. So, sit. Okay. Yeah. I'm seated. I'm seated. Um, I'd like you to tell me everything you know about Mr. Ken. Everything, uh, seen, uh, what and what? Everything. Everything. In total. Is that so difficult? And don't lie to me. If you lie, I'll know. Uh, uh, well, uh, you see, my yoga has only one problem, uh, which you already know. Uh, <laughs> eat and run. Uh. Chop and clean mouth. Disappointment without remorse. Treating women as if they are nothing. That's all. See, apart from this problem, my yoga is a very, very nice man. I did a boy draw. I'm telling you. That idiot is back. That fool. Nkenke. Hi. Please, don't come out again. Let me just deal with him. Don't go there and start fighting. I didn't send you that message. Go and check who's in the gate and then come back. We haven't finished. Fight? No, I won't fight him. Am I am that crazy? I'm not crazy. You can't fight him. I will deal with him. Just. Okay. Okay. If I meet you there, you are very, very stupid. 
you have come back here. By the time I reach you there, you know, this thing the men that sit there. That's right. Apart, Apart from, from this, this problem, my young guy is a very, very, very nice, nice man. man. Okay, okay. You are very, very stupid to come back here. By the time I handle you, by the time I will deal with you now. Come. Uh, who are you? Who are you, please? T tell me who you are. I want to see the woman inside. Uh, which woman? Did who are you? Did you hear me at all? I I'm not deaf. I'm asking you who are you and which woman are you looking for? There's something wrong with you. Listen. If you are not able to answer a very simple question, then you are the one something is wrong with. Eh? Who are you? Who are, who are you looking for? You are, you are, you are talking about that. Ah, you, are, you can't come in here. <laughs> you cannot come in here. Ah, wait and let me do. I said I want to see the woman inside. And I said there is no woman inside. Ah, look, you are looking for the trouble of a retired army officer. A retired army officer. In your room. Do you know whom you are addressing in that tone? Who are you? No, who are you and what are you? Are you the one that pay my salary? Eh? Is this your house? What do you mean? I'm just let me let me love this. Namdi! Hey, madam! What's going on? What's the bickering about? Is it not this, 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 this man? Look, who is that? Eh? Who is that? I, I, I don't know. In fact, I will, I will, I will. Eh? Maybe even now. I'll... By the time I deal with you, by the. Get out of your daughter formula, and then I will discharge you with another left hand. V Vincent, madam, do do you know him? I thought this idiot said that you're not in. Hey, you come and idiot. Hey, it's okay. Um, let him in. You come and idiot. Would you calm down? Let him in. You wanted to, in fact, I wanted to rearrange his data formula. It's okay. She has saved you now. I would have, I would have shown you the stuff I'm made of. You don't know me. You don't know me. In fact, by the time I, I would have finished with you. How did you find me? There are questions you need not to ask one who sits on the ancestral stool of his father. I interacted with your father. And I've got my reservation on that said ancestral stool. What do you mean? You know exactly what I mean. Because I don't remember the last time we spoke to each other, Vincent. How did you get in here? How did you? Yes. The same way you can be at a place you want that way. The ability to be at a place that you want is from my father, right? You really feel that my father really loved you that much that he could give you a gift that has not given to his son. Oh no, tell me. I really don't know what you're doing here. Honestly, because I'm just giving you audience for old time's sake. You don't really understand it, do you? Listen and listen, Rigo. There is nothing like old time's sake. You are still my wife! And you cannot be with another, except I approved it. You're only trying to intimidate me, Vincent. And it's not going to work. It's not going to work. You're, 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 you're wasting your time. Hurry. Yes. You acted out of ignorance. And that in which you've done has not set you free. And it has not set you free.
You are a woman with the one of the mighty. A woman with aura of kings. You came with that aura. And I have given you the gift. I reserve for his wife. Anything you genuinely desire, you will have it. But if my soul will not see beyond this nose and discover the jewel in you, go ahead, rise above it and discover yourself. You had a jewel at the palm of your hands and you just let us slip away. I have risen above all that whole, all the humiliation you cost me. This ship have sailed. Get. Get it straight. As long as I've not released you, you are still bound to me. You can never marry another man except that said so. And any man that shares the bed with you will suffer severe consequences. That isn't exactly what your father told me. And quite frankly, it's him I believe, not you. My father was my father quite right, but I rode above me even before he died. The best thing you can do to yourself is just get your things and come back to me. Tell whoever you're sharing space in this house with to set his sight elsewhere or he will die. <sighs> in his worst, to be called more powerful than his father. My son compromised himself. That is what is facing him now. I reject that curse. And wherever that curse is coming from, it's going back to his or her sender. Okay. When it happens again and again, you know where to find me. I reject it! Vincent, I will never, never come back to you. Get that straight. It's not happening. You can't tell what tomorrow will be. Life in the mirror. To live my life the way I want it. Allow me to flex my life the way I feel it. <laughs> Take it easy, cause you done not tomorrow. Cause you done not tomorrow. I beg, I beg, free my sky. I beg, I beg, allow me to flex. I'd be you if I like it. Where is a witch where you need one? You cannot find her. Yes. <sighs> are you okay? Um, look at her. Witch, where are you coming from? Excuse me, what did you just call me? <coughs> You're a witch. Normally, you come from that place all the time. What are you doing at the backyard? Why are you coming from here? What's wrong with you? You've been drinking. Please. So what do you want to do? You want to touch my drink? What has come over no, you? No, you want to touch my drink. No! How about I use it to break your head? Eh? 
You bloody harlot. How about I use it to break your head? You bloody enemy of happiness. You a harlot. Is that not what you are? Olosho. Harlot, that is what you are. Oh, you are, I'm what? I'm not high. I'm telling you the truth. Why are you in my house? You have refused to leave because I did not pay for the one night that I spent with you. I have decided Please, to pay who you today. Says this is about money. No, who this says is about, about money. It is about money for you. You're high. Okay. I have decided to stop pay this you. Pen. Please stop it. You bloody harlot. See, I don't even know why I'm paying you in foreign currency. I should pay you in coins because you are not even sweet. Oh yes. You have decided to torment me. Torment? I am going to chase please, you. Please stop it. Stop it. Oh, if you stop push it. me a, if you if you push me again, eh? If you push me again. Don't, don't touch me. To hire some... Come and take your payment. Come here. Don't let that money touch This you. is payment don't let it touch for harlotry. You are a witch. You are a harlot. You. And a bloody torment in my life. Leave my life alone! I leave leave me alone! Ah! I won't go! I'm not going anywhere. Go! You're frustrating me. Hey. Cost me the day that I met you. <laughs> Ha! Ah, which leave me. Hi, ah, I look at you sometimes. I don't know which one you are. Whether you're a witch or a spirit. I don't know. Just leave my life alone. You need to just calm down. I am begging you. Leave just me. calm down. You are tormenting me. To live my life the way I want it. Allow me to flex my life the way I feel it. Oh, oh, oh. Take it easy, cause you done not tomorrow. Cause you done not tomorrow. I beg, I beg, free my style. I beg, I beg, allow me to flex.
Hello? All done, sir. Yes, sir. The room is now ready for you, sir. And you can always count on me, correct, boss? this thing goes. Hmm? I need my money first. You would have transferred this money to me, but you said you pay in cash. So where is the cash? Have I ever failed you, Rex? Now, you know me. You know that when I deliver, I usually deliver. Yeah. Relax. Can money for and back for ground? Girl, you know what? Trust me, okay? So it doesn't look like you're beginning to, you know, be difficult. Just trust me. Uh, by the time we're done, I'll do a transfer that is going to change your music. Mm. <laughs> that sounds nice. Uh, come on now. Uh, it's okay. So, are you sure about that? Of course, I'm sure. But let's just start from here. Okay, so, uh, where are we starting from? Right here. life do we live? Hmm? Why doesn't this man want to settle down? Hey! Look at the angel God sent to you. Instead of settling down with her, it's busy gallivanting. Hey! No. If you will listen to me, forget about that guy. He doesn't deserve a woman like you. Andrews, God brought him to my life for a reason. There's no way you will bring God into this. He is a mistake and you need to start seeing him as that. I understand. I know what you're saying. Because report got to us that is a womanizer, right? A chronic one at that who has no intention of stopping. He threw you out because he saw you as a threat who will unmask all his moves. Forget about that guy and we can continue our lives. I just have a feeling that God brought him to my life for me to save him from destruction. I know what I'm saying, trust me. And he made it clear to you that he doesn't need you to save him. Forget about this guy. Hello, uh, Mama? Hello, Ken. Ken, Umwam, you need to come home right away. Uh, Mama, what is it? What is it? Your father has been very sick. 
and he has refused to go to the hospital. He is insisting that you have a hand in it. Please, come home. Yes, come home, please. How? What, what, what is going on now? Hello? What is going on? What is happening to my life? Good morning. My name is Vincent. I am here to see Gift. Did she tell you she's here? Woman, I am here in my capacity as Vincent, the king. Go in there and tell her that I want to see her. I, I, I am sure she didn't give you her location. How were you able to cross the estate security and they, they didn't call me? You won't like it if you hold me down here longer than necessary. Just go in there and tell her that I'm here to see her. Babe. Mm -hmm. Vincent is here. <laughs> he wants to see you. I know he's here to see me. Mm -hmm. Tell him I'm not around. I'm not a believer, I don't want to say anything. How do I possibly tell him that? He might slap me or even force himself in here. Uh, that would be the reason why I would take him to prison quickly. Please, just <gasps> go and tell him I don't want to see him. <sighs> However we want to do it. How do I even, even go up? How do I do this? I don't know how to present this to him. Rose, anyway, anyhow you want to present it, present <gasps> it. I don't want to see him. It's that simple. Ah! Just go oh. tell him I don't want to see him. Okay, I don't want to see him. Okay, I will tell him that. Sorry. She's indisposed right now. She wouldn't want to come out. Did you tell her the person that is here to see her? Jane Vincent? I explained everything to her. She says she doesn't want to see you, and I cannot drag her out. Okay. Please tell her that I will be back. She belongs to me, and she cannot run away from me. The useless one who compromised himself. How would anybody want to have anything to do with him? Wait, 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 wait. What, what did you say? Wait, 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 wait. I want to back. I want to back. What did you say? Hey! How can this happen to me? Okay, how can you be telling me that the container that is carried by goods and, and the goods of my, uh, 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 my friends sank in, in the high sea? But they assured us that this would not happen. What, 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 what do you want me to do now? Don't tell me not to panic. Of course I panic. I panic. Everything is just going wrong. Everything is just going wrong in my life. What is going on? Then I'm shouting. Then I'm shouting at you. Hi. What is happening? No. This 
cannot be ordinary now. What is happening? Um, see, Martins, I don't know why you're reading meaning into all this. I don't just know why you're reading meaning into all this. Why will you be saying or thinking that all the things he's facing, all the things Ken is facing is connected to women? It's a natural thing that can happen to a businessman. Exactly. We all know how stupid government policies affect business. That is what is happening to here. When I listen to both of you, I, I just wonder where you got your reasoning from. You talk like people that don't have anything have common sense. What is happening to our friend Cain is not ordinary. See, you people should take it or leave it. Why should we take it? Huh? Martins, any person, even you, can experience setback in business. Yes, no. you guys understand? Let me put it straight to you. Cain is experiencing a setback. In other words, he's grounded. Nothing is happening. He's on his feet. He's not going forward. He's not going back. How, how do you guys want me to explain this thing to you people now? How do I explain it to you? See, um, Martins, I don't understand. Are you saying this because they seized his goods? And uh, now... It's not today they started seizing people's goods at the port. Not be today now. Or is it, is it because they, they stole his cars? Is it today that they have been stealing cars in this country? I, I wonder. Okay. Let me for once again make people understand. In the spate of a month, three luxury cars were stolen. Not one, not two, three were stolen. In just one month, everything went, all this business crumbled. The, 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 the container in the icy sank. The warehouse, everything was wet down by fire. And you people are here talking unintelligently. Please, if you don't have anything good to say, if you don't have any solution to proper, get out of my house. <laughs> Go away and let me think of a way forward. Uh, uh, Martins, Martins, you don't need to talk over, do your own. No? Martins, there is a saying that goes, the downfall of a man is not the end of his life. Uh -huh. There is always light at the end of the tunnel. Ken is coming back a big man. Oh, Take it or leave it. So, 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 what, what has that got to do with what you are saying? What has, what, what, is there any correlation to what you are saying and what I'm, uh, what, what I'm saying? Is that a solution that you are preferring? Ken is coming back a big man. It's okay, it's okay. I'll explain later. Okay, but, but, but what is going on? You, 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 you call me that papa. Why is he like this? Kenneth, I warned you. I warned you. Now see the calamity you have brought upon yourself and the family. Eh? What, did I, what did I do now? But, but, but... If anything happens to your father, if anything happens to your father, I will never, never forgive you. I will never talk to you again. Oh, oh. Wow. I will disown you! Hey. Son of Wachinemi, your chi is not happy with you. When a man abandons his chi, his chi abandons him. <laughs> Bless is the man whose chi is a woman, for no matter what he commits, his chi will remain a mother. But your chi is a man. Not just a man, but a coordinated warrior. He allowed them to carry out their plans. The, 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 the enemy has not just entered your house, but right with you everywhere you go. I know all of this. Now, and that is why I've come to you for help. Please help me. My father must not die. The falling of a son is the falling of a father. I want your father that this will happen. 
I told him to talk to you. But nobody is ready to sit with the Divya. And I ask, can the people live without the Divya? Please, and I, please, don't take this out on him. It's not his fault. Please help him. Can you count the sand at the seashore? No, no one can. That is how complicated your case is. You may have to appease all these girls you have caused so much hurt to, to be free. The son of Wachinemelo. Your chi allowed the demons of setback to take proper hold of you. I am willing to do anything possible to solve this problem right now. Please, whatever it is. <laughs> Who is gift? You know her? That lady is the only one that can heal you. Hi. The good man has already given her what your chi values. If you can appease her, then you shall be like a tree planted by the riverside. Hi, my friend told me. My friend told me the same thing you're telling me now. That is the only one you can call your true friend. Find that lady. Specify her. And your problems are solved. Um, how may I help you, sir? I am here to see Igwe, the king. Do you have an appointment? Oh, no. Uh, but I believe he knows me. What is your name? Wachine Melukenet. That's my name. But call me Ken. Wachine Melukenet. Okay, just stay here. Let me go and inform him. Thank I'll you. I'll be back. He said he, he doesn't know you. That means you're not welcome here. Okay. Tell him that I know where the queen is. Eh? His ex-queen. I know where she is. She's in my house. Sit down. Thank you. The king will be with you shortly. Ah. You great. You are the one who dug his grave by sleeping with the woman who is joined with me to my soul. Oyeze, I can say with all sense of humility that you have understood this whole situation wrongly. 
I have come here today to explain, and if you give me a chance, I promise you, Onyeze, that I am going to do justice to that explanation. Can you stand by my father's grave and swear that you've not had kind of knowledge of the woman married to a king? You draw conclusions, Onyeze, and once again I submit that your conclusions are wrong. Are you talking to me like that? Are you mad? Do you actually know whom you're talking to? Oh yes, Onyeze, I know who I am speaking to. You are a king, but then I have the approval of your father, a good man, to tell you that you're a loser. A loser who lost a gem still wants her back. A gem that I've had in my bed for weeks now. <laughs> for standing here and accept that you actually had carnal knowledge of my woman, has crippled you. We may need to be mindful of the actions that we take. For men are not always exactly what they look like. And what do you mean by that? I was told that you stormed my house in my absence, Hugo. I have come to reciprocate that visit. Leave now. Leave before I do something nasty. Why are you watching me? I'm not, listen, I'm not done with the king. Okay, I still have a few things to sort out with the king. I, look, I have a few things to explain to the king. Sir, do you think you feel that we should go out of the palace? Please, just let's go, sir. Okay, okay, I'll leave. Don't, don't hassle me, I'll leave. Let's go, sir. Let's go. Go step outside and check out I've heard you running with someone. Who is the person? That useless fellow. He has no right to be here. Who is the person? That one that dug his grave by sleeping with gift. Are you serious? Where is he? If I get in here next time, I will kill him. He will be a dead man. Good mother. Open the gate for me. Go to the Ah, no but I said open the gates and tell that man to come inside. What is wrong with you? Okay, my friend. Okay. You are the young man who wants to see the king? Yes, Your Majesty. Why? Oh, I'm friends with um, the ex-queen. Very close friends, you know. We, we really got fond of each other at the times that we spent together. You know, until I messed things up, I, I got under her skin and then she disappeared. So I have been going everywhere looking for her, hoping to get one more chance to, to make things right with her. That's why I'm here. So what's your name? My name is Kenneth. What's your name, Ellen? I have looked everywhere for her. I've just been searching for her. That's why I'm here. I don't know where she is. Men. Men. I don't know why you men never learn. Same mistake my son made. Now he wants her back. Indeed. We never realize the value of someone until we lose them. I'm so sorry, Your Majesty. I... Now I know better. I have learned my lessons. If only I can see her just one more time. To behold her face in the palm of my hands and tell her how much she means to me, I will do it. It's okay. I have heard you. 
your majesty. I speak to you from the depths of my soul. And I mean it when I say that I am sorry for everything that I did to gift. Everything I did, I did in ignorance and stupidity. Life has taught me a few lessons. Now I know more. And I'm a better man. And that is why I am here. Please. It's okay. I will excuse both of you now. Why are you here, Ken? Because I wronged you. That's why. Gift. I have done a lot of things to you. Things that I am not proud of. I'm not even worthy of you. But I am here to ask your forgiveness. Just so that I can I can have some peace, gift. You are my peace. And losing you would mean losing everything. What is going on here? Your gift. I suppose you're here to take your rightful place. No. I'm here because your mother asked for me and of course to take him back. Take who back? Take me back. Are you out of your mind? No. I am with my mind. You lost your mind when you compromised yourself just because you wanted to be bigger than your father. It turns out that you're nothing. You can't be talking to me that way. You belong to me. What have you done to yourself? No, tell me. What have you done to yourself? Your father fortified me against your weird acquired powers. And let me warn you, you better be careful what you do going forward. I say you belong to me. You belong to me. And I do not dispute that. But the fact that you have lost me, totally, totally lost me. And if you still think you want to be the man that will keep calling the shots in my life. I am calling upon my ancestors to come and bless this Kola not for me. I am now the king. I want to rule in line with the ways of my father. Vincent, you have no right to call on the ancestors. For you are not a man of the ancestors. Father, what are you saying? The power you acquired in your quest to become mightier than the mighty has crippled you in your spirit and you have lost everything. A new king will emerge to heal this land of your evils and that king will not come from you. Will you allow Royal to leave your family? Father, why? She would have given you peace. But you lost the peace. And the peace is now with someone else. He might be Randy in actions. But he is found with purest of hearts. Go into battle with him. And I will fight in his place. If you think you still have me, take my hand. And let's end this now, once and for all. Do you realize there are consequences? You cannot remarry or have sex with any other one unless you do the needful. That is, if I ever release you from the bond we share. On the purity of the soul of your father, 
I've already been declared free. Yes, I'm a free woman. And there are no consequences from any weird person that will affect the sacred people. Take my hands. Prove to him. Let him know that he has no grip on me. Do not listen to him. For she belongs to me. She used to belong to you. But you blew that opportunity. And now she is God sent to me. The one who was created to complete me. Now for that reason I am going to take any risk for her. I shall take her hand for your father has already given her to me. And I say, if I die, let me die. I have submitted myself to you, Gift, for I know that you are the one that have been sent to salvage me. Thank you for all that you have done. The promise is sure. The glory of the latter shall be better than the former. So now he's killing you slowly In the middle 